Hello, my name is Veronica. I'm a trainer and this video is created to help other trainers with an idea for an interactive exercise. Unemployed, educationally disadvantaged Roma women are often confronted with the dilemma that, on the one hand, they would be willing and motivated to develop their skills in order to enter the labor market, be employed, receive salaries, seize opportunities. But on the other hand, they rarely have financial means or the support of their families or the communities. Even unemployed, low-skilled Roma women who are educationally disadvantaged have a multitude of talents, competences, qualities and strengths. They have extensive and valuable experience in a wide range of areas like household, child care, cooking, creativity and communication. This is exactly the focus of the method we are going to show you. It is about raising awareness and subsequently marketing these talents, strengths, competences, skills and abilities within a framework of a talent exchange market. For the exercise you will need paper, pens, pins or strips, as well as products prepared by the participants. The activity can take few hours depending on the group size. Let's start! Participants receive cards on which they are invited to write down their talents, strengths, competences, qualities, abilities and skills. For example, I'm a good cook, I can sing well, I'm good at telling stories, I can dance, I'm good at energy balancing, etc. Participants present their talents, strengths, competencies, qualities, abilities and skills in turn in the plenary session and pin or stick the cards to a dedicated pin board or on the wall. The trainers make sure that these are clustered, for example, two cards from women who can dance. Participants are given the assignment to think about which products, self-made clothes, accessories, food, etc. or services they would like to prepare and offer in the talent exchange activity. They can be invited to cluster with participants with the same or similar talents in small cooperatives of 2, 3 or 4 people depending on the group size. In the cooperatives the participants discuss who will bring what to the talent exchange day and offer it for exchange. During the talent exchange day, participants and trainers first of all redesign the working space so that each team can present and market its products and services in the best possible way. Design of sales stands, communication and consultation corners, stage of singing performances, etc. Then the talent exchange market starts, where the participants should exchange as many talents, products and services as possible. Participants are engaged in a final reflection activity. The following guiding questions might be used. Which of my talents, strengths, competences, qualities, skills and abilities have I offered? What have I received from the other participants in return? What have I learned about myself through the talent exchange? What am I particularly proud of? 
could I imagine using, offering and marketing my talents, strengths, competences, qualities, abilities and skills professionally? The group is gathered again in the circle for final sharing about the feelings and ideas that emerged in the exercise. As you saw, it is an interactive and effective exercise. It works for building confidence and developing better presenting skills. In step one, the participants write some of the talents on cards. In step two, they present their cards, pin or stick them on the wall and cluster in small group with the women with similar talents. In step three, the participants plan the talent exchange market. Step 4 is the actual exchange. In step 5, there is a discussion in the small groups. And step 6 is the final sharing. For the exercise and for our job as trainers in general, it is very important to set the atmosphere. It is good to be supportive and to share at the end that you will take all the talents from the market. It is also the time to make a parallel with the real market where the participant can try to present with more confidence and ease.